Welcome back, chimps, to another episode of Guitar Chimp Television. Now that you've seen and heard Rich play this thing, I'm gonna talk about it. Okay, so today we've got a 1978 Gibson ES335 TD. The weight on this guitar is eight pounds, six ounces. It has what I'm gonna call a slim taper neck. It's the late 70s Gibson neck. The nut width is 1.68 inches. The depth at the first fret is 0.81 inches and the depth at the 12th fret is one inch even. It has a rosewood fingerboard, um, a very massive volute on this, which I, I, I very much so enjoy, makes for a stronger headstock. And then the pickups are Gibson Tarback pickups. It comes with the original case, does not have a certificate of authenticity because they didn't make them in 1978. Very, very, very cool uh, vintage 335. What is that, a walnut top, I believe? And then uh, has block inlays on it. Really hard, but just really nice guitar. And then um, the coil tap. I'll let you talk about that, I suppose, yeah. when we get there. All right, we'll start with the neck pickup here. Okay. Um, right now it's in humbucking mode. Uh-huh. And um, should I switch to stand? actually goes to a true single coil. Oh yeah. Which is nice. I mean, I'll, I'll stay in single coil mode here for a yeah. second. Mm -hmm. So if Gibson couldn't make the 335 any more versatile, yeah. they added a coil tap. Now it can really do anything. Yeah. Yeah. So this is still, okay, bridge pickup, still single coil. So you get a little bit of twang out of it too. Uh-huh. So let's go back to, um, actually, let's just go back to um, humbucking mode. We'll just. That's the, uh, that was the net, uh, bridge pickup. Here's okay. The neck pickup. So now we've kind of heard them all on the clean sound. Let's go to a slightly dirty sound and we'll go to the bridge pickup. And then um, the both pickups together. Mm -hmm. but on this particular one you can even with that much distortion you can hear yeah the two pickup settings mm -hmm. okay and then finally the um rich <laughs>
going on, chips? If you like what you saw, go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button. If you don't like what you saw, go ahead and hit the dislike button and leave me a comment. Ooh.